It's so good. I saw excitement. Excited? 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm so happy about that. Quite a lengthy introduction, don't you think? Well, she deserved every second of it. Obviously, she's fast, but it appears that she's actually faster than we all thought. The Polish track and field sprinter is making her way to the top, and she's ready to take on whoever stands in her way to the podium. So, who is this fast-rising track star? Evan Nicholas Swoboda is a Polish track and field sprinter who specializes in the short sprints. She is a three-time European Indoor Championships medalist in the 60 meters, having won the gold medal in 2019 and silvers in 2017 and 2023. She is also a one-time World Indoor Championship silver medalist, one-time European Championship silver medalist, two-time European U23 champion, eight-time national champion, and eight-time national indoor champion, among others. Unsurprisingly, Swoboda began competing in athletics at a young age. After joining the UKS Sorka Zori Athletics Club, she began training under her coach Iona Krupa. She won the Polish youth title in 100 meters in 2011 and 2012. The following year, she won the National Indoor Junior 200 meter and made her international debut at the 2013 World Youth Championships in Athletics and finished fourth in the women's 100 meter with a time of 11.61 seconds. Even then, she was the best European in the race. She then ran a personal best and Polish junior record of 11.54 seconds in the 100 meters at the Polish Youth Olympic Days, where she completed a sprint double. By 2014, she claimed the Polish indoor junior title in the 60 meters and finished fifth in the 100 meter outdoor at the 2014 World Junior Championships in Athletics. Then, at the European Youth Olympic Trials in Baku, she won the 100 meter and was runner-up in the 200 meter, which made her one of the favorites for the 2014 Youth Olympics, where she ran a new best of 11.30 seconds in her opening race. That made her the second fastest junior athlete that year. She then won her first senior national title at the 2015 Polish Indoor Championships, and she also set a 60-meter European junior record of 7.21 seconds during the competition, which was also a world best for a 17-year-old. This gained her selection for the 2015 European Athletics Indoor Championships, her first senior appearance for Poland. Long story short, she won many events as a track and field sprinter before turning professional in her country and around the world. She plays her role mostly in short sprints. Her coach, Iona Krupa, played a huge role in building a stable career. Krupa has been her coach since the time Eva got into athletics. According to Krupa, despite Swoboda's success, some people still doubt her ability to teach elite sprinters, and they frequently criticize her. For her part, Eva has been proving the naysayers wrong. This year, too, she's proving to be a strong competitor. In fact, in late January, Swoboda clocked 7.07 .07 to break the meet record in the women's 60 meter at the World Indoor Tour meeting in Ostrava. What's more, a few days later, she produced another scintillating piece of sprinting on home soil at the Copernicus Cup in Torun, a World Athletics Indoor Tour gold meeting. In a near rerun of the 60-meter final at the Orlin Cup in Lotz, where she set a world lead of 7.04 the previous week, Swoboda pounced out of the blocks and narrowly held off the quickly improving Italian Zainab Dosso, who tracked the pole with real intent on her immediate inside. After winning in Lotz with 7.04, Swoboda maintained her unbeaten winning streak in 2024, with victory in a world lead of 7.01 ahead of Dosso, who improved her Italian record from 7.05 to 7.02 to finish 0.01 behind Swoboda for the second time this year. I felt very good after today's performance. Each run is getting faster and faster, which is motivating. That's how it's supposed to be, she said. I'm glad the Italian was pushing me from behind. It was an additional motivation to run faster. She also added, Today's run is a great forecast before the upcoming Polish Championships and World Indoor Championships. My only goal at the moment is to train in health for these two events. She was indeed on target for her first global senior medal at the World Athletics Indoor Championships in Glasgow. Second in the world this year over 60 meters, only Julian Alfred, with the 6.99 she ran in New York, has gone faster so far this year. 
Eva is sure to be well supported at the Scottish venue. Mind you, not only is it the same arena in which she won the European Indoor Championship 60-meter gold in 2019, but she also has strong family ties nearby. It's a big event for me, she says. I want to win a medal and a PB. I like Glasgow. It's also close to where my brother lives in Edinburgh. Enjoying her current success on the track, Swoboda embraces being an extrovert figure in the sport. Her heavily tattooed body, painted nails, and playful personality have won her a legion of fans at home and overseas. I'm not playing any role, she said. I'm just Eva. I am open. I don't have a problem smiling. It's important. I like what I do, and I'm happy. She also welcomes being part of the current era of the women's 100 meters and its colorful crop of champions, particularly world champion Shakari Richardson. I love to run with Shakari, she noted with a smile. Shakari is a gorgeous girl, and her energy is welcome, and it's nice to be a part of this little family. This year promises to be a huge one for Swoboda, with the World Indoor Championships, European Athletics Championships, and the Olympic Games all in her plans. First Glasgow, then Rome and Paris. Speaking of Glasgow, Eva Swoboda finished second in the women's 60-meter sprint, collecting Poland's first medal at the World Athletics Indoor Championships on the second day of competition. The Polish athlete was pipped to the post in the final by St. Lucian's Julian Alfred by just 0.02 seconds. Alfred triumphed with a time of 6.98. After the race, Swoboda admitted that she felt a little disappointed with her performance in the final, as she clocked up 6.98 in the semifinals, improving her own national record. I was hoping to win. I was ready for it, but I'm happy. Silver is nice too. I had a strong three runs behind me, but I gave it a go, she said. I hope that the underachievement will motivate me to continue. In the final, I got two tenths because I wanted too much. In the warm-up, I felt that I gave a lot of myself in the preliminaries and semifinals. I'm happy with the Polish record, well, and I'm the world vice champion. Notably, the medal is the 26-year-old Polish sprinter's first at an indoor world championships. For context, she finished fourth two years earlier in Belgrade. Anyhow, following her impressive performance at the World Indoor Championships in Glasgow, Eva Swoboda has moved up to first place in the European rankings of female sprinters. She took the top spot from Britain's Dinah Asher Smith. The ranking takes into account the results in the 50, 55, 60, and 100 meters. Swoboda has 1,377 points, six more than Asher Smith, whilst Daryl Nieta is in third with 1,340 points. It helped that earlier in March, Swoboda took silver in the 60-meter sprint. On the way to the final, she set a new Polish record of 6.98 seconds. In the World Athletics Ranking, which incorporates all female athletes in the world, Swoboda is currently fifth. It goes without saying that she is hitting peak form at just the right time, especially with the Olympics in Paris this summer. At the age of 26, she will probably consider this her best chance at winning an Olympic gold. Will we see her in Paris? Well, stay tuned. And here's yet another athlete we need to keep an eye on on the way to Paris.